Hi, Peter from Power Director Tutorials here. Today I'm going to show you how to make your own video slideshows out of photos. Power Director provides some kind of wizard. We can just chuck in our photos, choose a template and it will spit out some kind of video. And some examples of those we'll take a look at right now. So here's one of them. Here's another example of a different template. So that's what I'm going to be showing you right now. So what we need first are, are a bunch of photos. So I'm just going to go through my Hong Kong photos here and chuck in some random ones. So let's do that now. Okay, we just drag those into the media room in Power Director. And you'll notice that uh, you might have some videos that are upside down or sideways. So what we can do is right click those and choose uh, rotate left or right. Or we can edit them in photo now. You might not have this option available, uh, whatever version you've got. So let's just uh, rotate this one to the right. And that should create a copy there. We can just remove the original. I won't do it for the rest of them. Uh, that's just to show you anyway. So drag those onto the timeline, onto the video track there. And they should all be selected by default. Uh, if you happen to misclick, you can select them all again by clicking the left one, then shift clicking the rightmost one to select them all again. What we do now is hit the slideshow button here. You can choose a style here. So let's go with highlight. It's done. You can also optionally add a music track. So I've selected a track, a free music track from danosongs.com. So let's just chuck that in there. And that enables mu music preferences. You can uh, crop the music and uh, disable fade in and fade out. That's about it for music. You can also select slideshow preferences. So what we've got here, fit photos to music or fit music to photos. Or we can change the order of the photos to whatever date you've uh, taken them on instead of how they appear in the timeline. And then you just click next and it will do its thing and generate a video. So we can preview it here. And let's click next. Here you can confirm the photos. So yeah, I chucked in 10 photos and 10 photos were processed. So that's working. We just wait a bit here. Alright, so there, there we go. We've got a slideshow here. It's converted into a video, so we can uh, do the usual things we do with videos. You can add text on that. You can put title screen beforehand or put some kind of video afterwards. Whatever you want to do with a video, you can do. So in this particular example here, I want to show some text showing uh, what these photos are about. So before I get to before I get to that, we can also uh, re we can adjust it again by clicking s slideshow and just going through the motions again to choose a different style or update the settings. Okay, so let's take a look at that here. All right, looking good, but uh, you probably won't have any idea what these photos are about, so. Let's get to putting some text on there. Drag that onto the text timeline there. Make sure it's the same size as the video. And we just edit the text by double clicking and changing this. Choose 
choose a template or you can just customize your own and let's just rotate this a bit and put that corner there and let's just give it a starting effect here so starting effect right up there that's good enough and a ending effect there and we adjust these orange bits here so that blue bit there indicates the actual timeline of the effect so the shorter, shorter it is the faster the effect so let's put that towards the end there all right that's it we've got our finished slideshow here let's just take a look at that so there we go that's our slideshow